charity and we can't rely on voluntary contributions from people to support the things that government does. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the patriotic millionaires. President Kennedy said, ask not what your country can do for you, ask what you can do for your country. To our elected leaders, we say, it is time to ask us, America's most fortunate citizens, to do what we can do for our country. Our position here today is we ought to return to at least the levels that were in, ex in existence before the tax cuts of 2001 and that were part of a very successful society. The economy is doing a lot better in the 1990s with tax rates at that level than they've been over the last 10 years. This week the super committee has a job to do. We will ask them to do something that will affect us and our fellow 0.01 percenters about as much as a dead fly interrupts a picnic. Each of the people standing with me and each of the 200 millionaires we represent believe that the very first step the Congress should make, the very first step should take uh, toward this goal is to immediately end the Bush tax cuts for incomes over one million dollars a year. People earning over a million dollars a year and they pay lower tax rates on average than the middle class. The country over the past ten years through uh, two unfunded wars uh, through uh, tax cuts to its wealthiest citizens has dug a hole that is bigger than the hole that was dug by World War II. The economy's in trouble, national debt is in trouble, we don't have the jobs we need to sustain the economy. We have actually undermined the employment gains our economy made in the private sector by firing thousands of workers in the public sector. Just to emphasize this point, we have been firing people who work for us because we are unwilling to ask a few of the more fortunate Americans to pay exactly what they were paying just a few years ago in taxes. Are these people necessary and important for our society? Yes, absolutely. And they have to get paid. And because they work for us, they must be paid by the people through taxes. Because we made a lot of money from our society, more money from using these functions, we should invest more in maintaining it. We here at The Last Word are happy to provide equal time to any of America's greedy millionaires who would like to come here and explain why they just can't afford to pay one more dollar in taxes.